Hey guys, it's Mrs. Bradford. I am going to uh, draw a lion with you today. It's going to look like this, and it's really simple, basically out of shapes. So what I wanted to see, if you guys would like to draw with me, you're just going to need some crayons, a piece of paper, and we'll draw our lion together. Okay, so you can pause this, get what you need, and come on back. All right, so we are going to assume that everyone's back now. And the first thing you're gonna do is draw a circle. And what I've got is a lid to my protein powder, <laughs> but that is what I'm gonna to use to trace my circle. So it doesn't have to be a perfect circle, but if you want it to be, uh, if you want some help with it, you can just find something to trace and you've got your circle. Okay, and the next thing we're going to do is we're gonna draw two little half circles for his ears. There we go, and then they have little half circles inside them to make it look like an ear. Kind of looks like teddy bear right now, doesn't it? The next thing you're going to do, I need to turn this around for you, is we're going to draw his nose. His nose is also sort of a half circle, so we just go up and down, and then we're going to color that in. Okay, we want it to look black. All right, I went out of the lines. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. That's okay, because it's my art and it can be however I want it, right? Just like you guys. It's... And then you're gonna need some eyes. I'm gonna use blue for my eyes. And the eyes are just little circles. You can make them as big or small as you want. Color those in. They can be black, blue, green, whatever color you want brown. Um, and then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to need to draw some whiskers on our lion um, and his mane. So what we'll do is we'll draw some whiskers. He's going to have three on each side. One, two, three. And on this side, one, two, three. The last thing you're going to do is draw his mane. So what we have to do is we have to just make his mane all the way around his head. Don't worry about if your whiskers are there. It's totally fine because his whiskers might be all the way into his head. And just keep going all the way around. You can make your lines as close or as far apart as you want. Again, it's your art, so you make it however you want it to be. Okay, so we got our brown on. Now we're gonna do orange. Orange is next, same thing. You just keep drawing your lines all the way around him, all the way around his head for his mane. Look at that. We gotta name the, our lion, don't we? You give a name for your lion. And I'll think of one for my lion, too. Okay, and then lastly is the yellow crayon. Yellow, same thing. So we're making his hair look like a scut. Lots of different uh, colors of of the lion, so that it uh, makes him very colorful and very unique as well. All right, whoops! <laughs> so we just keep going all the way around, and there you have the lion. Oh, we forgot one important thing. How is this lion going to eat? He doesn't have a mouth. We better draw that next. So all we have to do is draw a line straight down from his nose and happy. And again, straight down from his nose and happy. He has a happy face. He is a friendly lion for sure. I think I'm gonna name him, my lion's name is gonna be, hmm, I think I'll name him Bear even though he's a lion. <laughs> Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great evening. Bye.